Welcome to a demo movie of Moksha Video Stream. Moksha Video Stream is a product that is integrated in sites, Cumulus Web Client, and portals. It already exists for a couple of years, and many of our customers have used it in the past in sites. And we're happy to announce today that we now also have it available in Cumulus 10 for portals and Cumulus Web Client. Why do we need a product like uh, VideoStream? Well, one of the main problems with managing videos is the preview. If you want to preview a movie in your browser, it either requires a plugin installed like Flash or QuickTime, um, or if it's your browser supports HTML5, what most browsers do, it still uh, needs a very specific prepared uh, video format to be able to preview. Another challenge uh, is that if you are managing your high res original files in uh, your Cumulus database, is that when you want to preview it, it's very very slow. It needs to download it completely before it can start playing it and uh, in case of big movies uh, that's uh, almost impossible. Luckily in portals it has already uh, improved a little bit and in Cumulus Web Client 2 where now HTML5 is used uh, to preview it but still you have a very big file which is demanding very big bandwidth and is very slow. The third challenge uh, which was very important with Cumulus 9 is that Cumulus sites did not support uh, iOS devices. Now that portals and Cumulus web client have been prepared for those iOS devices they support HTML5 which is widely supported on those uh, devices and on other tablets the only problem is that you still need a prepared video format to be able to preview it on those devices, which is not available out of the box because you have one single asset, one single file that is prepared for you. So first of all, video stream uses v uh, HTML5, so there are no plugins uh, required, and behind the scenes, RoboFlow prepares. Uh, the files for you in the right format. So you have the ability whenever a, a new video file is catalogued to define in what formats you want to offer this to the customer, to the user. First of all, which preview version you want to offer to the user. And that format can be pre-converted, prepared, uh, so that when the user clicks on the preview button it uh, pops up immediately and the same goes for your iOS devices. Let's have a closer look at the product. If I go to a Cumulus Web Client out of the box and I log in, you will notice that if I go to my video catalog, that if I try to do a preview of these videos, uh, of these videos, yes, uh, that it is not working. I can try even an MP4 file where you would expect it to work. It thinks I can support it, but it doesn't. And I can go on. If you were, if you have today already a video catalog which in which you prepared your uh, videos for FLV because that was the supported so, uh, format in sites then sorry, in the new Cumulus 10 version, it won't work. So, if we now go to not the out-of-the-box version, but the Cumulus web client that is integrated with Moksha video stream, if I log in, go to the content, and I go to my MPEG and I ask for a preview. A few seconds later it starts and it uh, automatically 
uh, playing the movie. Let's uh, try my MP4. I do a preview and after a few seconds you can see that it starts streaming the video and immediately the video plays. We will discuss this section uh, a little bit later. Other formats, FLV. In reality, you're not playing the FLV behind the scenes. It has a prepared, prepared MP4 that it uses to show as a preview, which is super fast, light, and immediately available. So I can go on over all these different formats and you will see that they all are functioning properly and you see nicely streaming getting your content while you are already watching the movie so this is the example of the cumulus web client same for portals if i look at the portals uh, of out of the box and if i have a closer look at my video formats when I click here I can see that it says not supported if I click here this one it supports it's an MOV uh, it's not very clear why it supports MOV here in uh, portals and not in the Cumulus web client but it doesn't you see here it doesn't here another MOV, the MOV it does support. So there is some support, but not a lot, as you can see. And so not supported. Not supported. And this one is supported. You see, so this is an MP4, it supports it. This is an MP4, it doesn't support it. So that's very difficult to um, offer this functionality to your users and that's why it's so important to have video stream integrated. If we have a closer look at the portals version with video stream integrated, you will notice that when I go to video and I click here on the window, it automatically charges the video and here I can have preview of my video. Even further, I can also go directly to the preview window where it plays. So we have it in both places. And so in the quick preview and in the full preview. Same for this one. And same for this one. For this one so now all these Two, formats one. are supported well in reality they're all using behind the scenes the mp4 but you are managing in your cumulus database you are just managing the original behind the scenes the overflow is managing the prepared versions they are stored in your vault so you can decide where to put them you don't need the large storage on your web server behind the scenes it's just using the direct URL technology of Cumulus to provide these previews in uh, your solution so that is what video stream offers you out of the box on top of that video stream so as I said sorry as a conclusion for your websites uh, of Cumulus we use HTML5 and Canto RoboFlow behind the scenes creates automatically your conversions. In a moment we will have a brief look at those workflows. They run automatically. All you have to do once in the beginning is define what converter to call with what parameters. So your video, video converter, we uh, deliver it with some pre-configured scripts for FFmpeg and for, or for Handbrake but you can use any other command line conver conversion tool. You can set up any parameters and fine tune any parameters that you like. The complete solution is standard Canto Cumulus products, nothing special. We just use proven technology for a flexible solution. The second benefit 
of using a video stream is that you can offer alternate formats prepared alternate formats of your videos if you're using Cumulus sites portals or Cumulus web client you can only get to the original because you cannot in Cumulus convert a movie again if you only offer the original you only offer that 14 gigabyte file to your users which is very often not what they want and you can only uh, give them with the standard products the original full document not a part of it if they just want to clip uh, from here to there that's something that the product does not uh, out of the box offer you well with video stream the video converter part gives you the original but also the pre-converted formats uh, the video converter storage uh, stores the file that's on the cumulus side so you decide where to put your files you don't need uh, all this uh, bandwidth or all these uh, big files on your file server oh, sorry on your web server and in, uh, in your video converter in your preview window you get an option to select a part of the video so you can request a clip let's have a look at this live this is available in both portals sites and the Cumulus web client but you've already seen uh, most of it so let me quickly uh, go in here and give you an example if I want to uh, download this record I can see that I can download a prepared low-res version and optionally you can choose also to offer still the other conversions that might be available out of the box for Cumulus so either you can click here the biggest advantage is that the file already exists so you click and it's available immediately for the user it downloads as I said before using the direct URL technology um, so no waiting time for the user so this is a very simple option here is already your prepared video it's that quick you can as I said you can uh, have the option to show or not show this part um, so uh, if you offer the original asset it will also uh, be able to you will be able to offer it through this channel you can define your uh, asset actions to appear or not appear for videos and so you can have additionally your own if you offer the original if you don't offer the original this part will not be uh, visible that was uh, showing you how you can uh, download uh, prepared formats here's another uh, possibility and that is that you can ask for a clip you can say I want from a, a, a certain part maybe you're looking for it and say okay uh, you can scroll forward or, or backward in seconds or in minutes you can say I want ah, that's what I'm looking for so from here and then you can say okay I'll let it run yeah there they go dancing and okay and I want it to this particular spot and then you can just request the clip what happens is that this uh, website just behind the scenes talks to Roboflow and Roboflow will now prepare for you that and you can see that it pops up Roboflow does this automatically this never happens on the user side this is because I'm running my Cumulus server and my Roboflow, Roboflow server and my web server on the same computer and that I'm playing the user also on this computer that's why you saw this window pop up a user a real user will never see this pop up but so now we have a look if the mail has arrived and it has so the user gets an email and when uh, he clicks on it it opens in your browser offering you the possibility to download it or to have a look at it and so here's your uh, movie 
So that's how simple it is. You can simply request whatever uh, you think is necessary to conclude this presentation. The Moksha video converter is actually completely integrated in the download and preview and it's Canto RoboFlow that will have prepared the uh, formats for you up front uh, for the download section and in regards to that preparation it can use whatever video converter you want um, the, the framework just calls an external script and that external script out of the box comes with some examples for FFmpeg and Handbrake but you can use whatever tool you have uh, available as long as it is able to receive command line instructions. Again we're using uh, Canto Cumulus uh, standard uh, functionalities uh, so nothing fancy uh, or nothing extra to uh, install using proven technology to offer you more functionality. So thank you for joining uh, this presentation. As you know, video stream already exists for two, year, two years and was in Cumulus 9 used for sites. Now it is already also available for portals and for video stream.